Hi guys, how are you doing? I hope that you are doing fine. In this video tutorial, we will learn about the collision detection in Godot uh, by using the area 2D and uh, I will uh, uh, start from my previously created project. So let's get started. First we need to create uh, an uh, area 2D enemy. So let's create an enemy enemy okay enemy tscn and rename it to enemy okay and to work it needs a collision shape so let's add a collision shape collision shape 2d and define its extent and shape okay add a, a, a sprite node okay and uh, drag this default icon sprite to texture and uh, that's enough now uh, set uh, go to your project project settings and uh, search for okay uh, physics 2d physics okay name your player enemy okay that's enough close it and uh, this enemy uh, add this to the layer 2 because it is enemy and for mask to uh, mask layer is used to detect what you want to detect and uh, we want to detect player so I set the mask to player okay now open our player it's a kinematic body to the add a an area 2d and add uh, also add a collision shape define its shape and extents i will define it 50 by 50 i define the shape a little bit bigger than uh, 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 than sprite because i want to detect a player whenever a player enters this area enemy enters this area okay so also add the collision what it wants to detect it wants to detect enemy okay we just want to detect enemy whenever uh, an enemy enters in this area we want to report okay so uh, i add the mask for enemy okay now let's add our enemy in the world scene okay here we have our enemy it should not be the child of the collision shape okay we can put it here this place is fine okay now uh, go to the player scene select your area 2d uh, go to your node and uh, in here uh, select the area entered area 2d okay this signal and connect it to our player script okay uh, we will detect our enemy print area dot name okay so uh, now let's run our scene and see if it is working or not as you can see
okay it is detecting enemy you can uh, also uh, go to the visible collision shape uh, by going to the debug and uh, check this visible collision shape okay now we will see uh, the over collision shape when we run game and you will see that as we get closer to the player uh, sorry enemy it reports the enemy in the console okay that's it for this tutorial i hope that you enjoyed it please like share and subscribe to my youtube channel and uh, comment uh, below in the comment section if you want to ask anything thank you so much